Welcome to Drinking with Dragons. My name is Rourke, and today we are making the Marble Cake Shooter number one and number two. We're both going to have half ounce of coffee liqueur. I'm going with Patron XO. Good stuff. First one's also going to have half ounce Irish cream. I'm going with the Cool Swan. And half ounce chocolate liqueur. Godiva. The second one is going to have rum chata. Alright, let's get started, shall we? Okay. Half ounce. The reason I'm doing both of them is because I was debating on whether I should use rum chata or Irish cream. So I figure why not just use both? Alright. I'm gonna do the Godiva next on both because most of the time the creams usually sink below it. Okay. Half ounce. Okay. Doing it both at the same time just kind of speed it up a bit. <laughs> I try to keep my shooter videos shorter than my cocktail videos if I can. <sighs> Alright. Part two. Layering is actually kind of easy, but it is kind of time consuming. You gotta go at your own pace basically, otherwise it'll kind of fall into each other. And a shot like this is basically all about presentation. Alright. Finally, last but not least for the first one. Cool spawn. Awesome stuff. Yeah. Okay. You don't have to use separate measures, but I'm doing it kind of because for me it's easier. But yeah. Eh. Okay. Marble cake number two. Half ounce rum chata. Also very good stuff. Has kind of like a uh, carrot cake flavor to it. Others might say as I have in the past, ta tapioca kind of flavor to it. Either way, it's pretty good. Okay. One thing's for sure, Ramchata is weird. Not in a bad way, it's just... For some reason, Ramchata always wants to go to the bottom.
Mm. Marble cake number one, marble cake number two. Okay, here's the number one. Got the OXO coffee liqueur on the bottom, diver in the middle, cool swan on top. Here we have marble cake number two, rum chata on the bottom, because rum chata is weird. It likes to sink below everything, but that's what makes it so cool. Anyway, we have rum chata on the bottom, OXO on top, and then Godiva on top of that. Pretty interesting. Let's try them out. That was number one. From Marvel Cake number one, you're getting a nice black coffee bean flavor, followed by a nice chocolatiness from the Godiva, and in the finish, you're getting that nice Pool Swan flavor. Pretty good. Alright, let's go with number two. From the second one, you actually get the rum chata first, followed by a quick punch of the uh, coffee liqueur from the OXO Patron. Then you get a nice wrapping of the Godiva, which is pretty nice. It smooths, and smooths out the coffee attack. They're both pretty good. I definitely say try them. Okay. Marble Cake Shooters, number one and number two. Thank you for joining me. My name is Rourke for Drinking with Dragons. See you next time and drink responsibly.